In this video we will clean the resin tank of an SLA printer. Step 1. Prepare a funnel and a bottle for resin. As a side note, this is a mix of clear and gray resin, and you can see the separation. So always agitate you resins well before use. Step 2. Drain resin from the tank into the bottle. Step 3. Leave the tank in the upright tilted position to let as much as possible amount of resin to drain. Make sure you don't expose the tank to direct sunlight or strong light from other sources. My lamps are protected with amber Kapton tape. Step 4. While the resin is draining, prepare a piece of tissue paper to clean the bottom corner of the tank from resin. Also prepare a surface to store the used tissue paper and other dirty materials used in this procedure. Step 5. When no more resin drains from the film, remove the tank from the funnel and place it on a clean paper towel on any suitable surface. Never place your resin tank on hard surfaces, as any small particles present can damage the film. So this is my draining arrangement with a bottle connector I sometimes use for draining of resin bottles. Step 6. Remove the funnel, close the bottle, and remove them to a safe place not to spill resin and flood the neighbors below you. Step 7. Prepare some IPA, ethanol, or water depending on resin, a cotton disc, a glove, a piece of tissue paper, and a jar or similar vessel for the washings. Step 8. Pour some cleaning agent into the vat. Do as shown in the video. Leave it for a minute to let alcohol dissolve resin. Step 9. After rinsing, drain the first portion of the washing agent into the jar. I am using this beaker to show you the amount of ethanol used for this procedure. Wipe the corner of the tank. Step 10. Pour another portion of the cleaning agent into the tank, and repeat rinsing. This time pay more attention to the walls of the tank and portions of the film where resin still remains.
Step 11. Pour the third portion of the agent into the tank, and use the cotton disc soaked well in the cleaning agent to gently wipe the film and the walls of the tank. Add more agent as needed to keep the surfaces wet. Use both sides of the disc. Check the film cleanliness against the light source. Step 12. Remove the wet cotton disc to the surface prepared in Step 4. Add the final portion of the agent into the tank. Rinse the film and the walls well and drain the cleaning agent from the tank. You can use a different storage jar with a cleaning agent for the portions from Steps 11 and 12. You can see the tiny amount of ethanol I used for cleaning. Add some small amount soaked by the cotton disc. Step 13. Now we need to blot the traces of the cleaning agent using the piece of tissue paper we prepared earlier. At this stage you can remove the glove from your hand. Gently absorb ant droplets from the film using soft tissue paper. If you don't remove the drops or wet spots they may turn to cloudy spots after evaporation of the traces. Cleaning is complete. So, for this operation I used about 10 milliliters of ethanol, two pieces of tissue paper, and one cotton disc. Step 14. Make sure the LCD is clean and reinstall the resin tank to get your machine ready for printing.
Step 15. Wash your hands with soap. Thanks for watching and happy printing.